In this video, I'll be showing you how to connect your social media platforms to repurpose.io so that you can start your workflow automations. But also, I'm going to show you how to reconnect in case that for some reason you get disconnected. So when you log into repurpose.io, obviously you're not gonna see any of these workflows. You're not gonna have any connections. Um, so when you get started, one thing that I definitely recommend is that if you go to resources tab and you go to tutorial videos, you can get a step-by-step -step guide from Roy and it will play with you on how to get started with repurpose.io. So it's really cool. And he does a very good job at going through it with you and you can kind of choose what you want to do with it. But if, if you don't want to do that, just go to connections. You want to start adding all of your social media platforms. So if you didn't know already, we can do a lot of different ones, TikTok, Pinterest, YouTube, Google Drive, Facebook, personal Facebook page, LinkedIn, Twitter, Instagram, podcast, Snapchat. So there's a lot of different ones that you want to connect. And so this is the first step. Once you get into repurpose.io, you want to take advantage of this. And so you just go to the top right corner and do add a new connection. You can see if any of these uh, social media platforms that you have, you want to connect just in case. So it's really cool. You want to take advantage of them. And so for like example, if you click on Pinterest at the bottom right, if you click on that and then you can name it and then you connect. When you connect, you need to, it will try to log you into your Pinterest account. What you'll wanna do is either log in with your email or you can continue with Facebook or you can um, use your Google account. So you wanna make sure that's on the right one though. So you want to make sure that you have the right account connected and so on the right, if you, for example, put the wrong account, you can always go to like, let's say if you have your wrong TikTok account or your wrong Pinterest or your wrong YouTube, you can write, you can click these three dots right here, rename it, but you can also just reconnect. So I'll click on re reconnect TikTok. You want to do um, direct publish most likely, and then you do reconnect. It will bring up this configurator. You want to make sure that you're authorizing the right account. So this is a huge tip for you if you have multiple TikTok accounts. So first of all, you're giving us access to all the stuff so that we can repurpose these things for you. But if this, for example, if this was the right account, but if it's the wrong one, all you wanna do is go to switch account and you want to log into the other account. Once you do that, then you can reconnect. And so it will give you to the TikTok login screen. You can use the QR code, which I always do for my phone. You can use Facebook or Google however you want to log in, right? But for me, what's usually very useful is going on to TikTok on your phone. And then let me just pull it up right here, TikTok. And then whenever you're logged in, um, you can go to profile and go to the top right. And you can click my QR code. So then what you do is you press the scan button and you can literally just scan it with your phone. So you use the QR code you can just scan it with your phone like I just did. And I do confirm and it will log into that TikTok login and then I can authenticate my TikTok account. So a lot of different ways. So some of the tips to, for connecting, you wanna make sure that you're on the right account. If you have multiple accounts, you wanna make sure that all of them say active on here. One, every once in a while, not really due to repurpose.io, but sometimes like for example, YouTube will have an update or Pinterest will have an update. Facebook will have an update and their API will disconnect. So when you log into repurpose.io, normally if that happens, you'll see some kind of warning up here saying, hey, just so you know, you need to reconnect your TikTok. And then you simply just go to connections and you go to the right three dots and you do reconnect and make sure that you're on the right account. That happens every once in a while. So although that repurpose.io is very hands off, you do wanna make sure that your connections don't just get booted off for some reason. Like I said, it's not really always repurposed.io's fault. It's a lot of times the social media is just changing. Their API, you know, does something weird and then we have to just reconnect. So that's something to look out for and make sure that you're doing correctly. So that's what you have to do when you re when you reconnect your connections to all your social media platforms and then or if you're doing it for the first time just connecting for the first time. Because having that is the core function so that you can have your workflows being published every time. One extra little cheat sheet. If you have trouble for some reason connecting or like 
for example, if you have a problem with Instagram, you're having trouble connecting, you can go to the help center on the top right You can click Instagram connecting and troubleshooting. So this is a very, it's a basically where we do all of our help support um, tickets here. You can see, and it will go step by step on how to do it. So that way you're not having any questions. And if even then you're still having troubles with any kind of connections, on the bottom right, there's a little chat box, or when you go to your normal screen, on the bottom right, there's another chat box. You can literally talk to our support team and we can help guide you, or we will give you the resources to do that. So we really wanna help you guys make sure, because some people join Reapers.io and don't even connect their stuff, and that means you're never gonna have all your auto automations and workflows going. We wanna make sure you guys are, get that task done so you can start automating, distributing all of your content all over the place. So make sure that your connections are there, Make sure that they're reconnected if they, for some reason, get disconnected. And more than anything, just enjoy all the different automations that we have with Repurpose.io. Let me know if you have any questions with connections or reconnecting. Let me know if you have any questions about Repurpose.io in general, because I'm definitely able to make videos based on your questions in the future. If nothing else, hope you have a wonderful day and we'll see you guys in the next video.